And a quick throw out in the flat to Eli Stove. And Stove with a quick 14-yard pickup. On third and six, Knicks the quick slant, and it's a first down. That's it. That's what he has to do. Again, the slant, again complete. First down, Seth Williams, third down and ten. Knicks wanted to throw the slant, now scrambles to try to find a receiver. Found one short of the first down is Seth Williams by about three yards. I Georgia still hasn't allowed an opening possession score. Arian in the backfield for Georgia on a second down and four gets the call and gets the first down. I've said this before, but you get Elijah Holyfield just standing on the sideline. Yes. On first down from gonna go deep. Got a man out there and get him. Dominique Blaylock. Touchdown. right there playing off outside technique poor technique no safety in the middle of the field he just runs right by tut and inside those big guys we talked about can they hold it and give them time quick throw out in the flat to Whitney. he slips a little bit got back across the original line of scrimmage and that's it fourth down and punting situation for the tigers from Pressure this time. He's going to go down, and it's Marlon Davidson. There's his buddy. As Marlon said, Marlon's going to do what he do, and he just got the sack and Jake Fromm. Yeah. <laughs> right? That's his six-and-a-half sack of the season, doing what he do right there. <laughs> and he went over a big man, Andrew Thomas, right there. And I believe him. He's an out pretty athletic on it goes back. Meantime, Jake Fromm rolls to throw, and nobody out there. They got eight men in the box. There's the count this time. And it's a direct snap to Whitlow, and he's not going to get there. Got about a yard. Direct snap coming. And hesitates, tries to cut back. There's nowhere to hide. Drop by David Marshall. From fires in and out of the hands of Dominic Blaylock. Would have been a first down, but a nice play by Javaris Davis. Back in the Auburn backfield. Knicks to throw down the middle. Got it. Seth Williams on the run. Williams with a stiff arm. Out to the 45 yard line. It was one of their biggest plays. Third and nine. Knicks fires complete to short. So it's good for a first down. Four. Now they go quickly, and it's Knicks on the keeper. He lost the ball. Might be Georgia. Knicks had a second chance at it, but I think it slipped away. Jermaine Johnson might be on the bottom of that pile. Richard LeCount's down there, and LeCount's got the ball. Run the quarterback. Would have been successful, but just the reach out, just enough by Johnson to poke that ball loose right on the football, and that popped it out. I do not like quarterbacks carrying their ball in the non-dominant hand. They do not practice it. Would turn into something bad. Here's a pitch. DeAndre Swift. Swept into the secondary this time. Out to the 40. I think 16-yard pickup to the 40. And I from looking to throw. And hit the knee, I think, of his intended receiver, Kyrus Jackson. And penalty. It's going to be interfer uh, pass interference. Dogs from their own 47. From throws complete. Out of bounds. Kyrus Jackson. Curry. Draw play. DeAndre Swift. DeAndre Swift is Swift. And almost took it. There's his patented move, too, when he breaks the line of scrimmage. I'm under center. Play fake. Fromm's going to loft it to Harrion. Brian Harrion. Touchdown, Georgia. Five-yard scoring toss, and Georgia does get a touchdown before halftime. Third and four. Fromm looking the other way. The throw is knocked away by Roger McCreary. They picked on him a couple of times. A quick wide out screen to Williams. Boy, Georgia's all over it. It wasn't accurate enough. Receiver screen on short yardage. You have to hit it so he's running. And he did not. The jump slowed him down and allowed D. 
DJ to make the tackle. DJ Daniel, 4-4 closing speed there. It didn't take long for him to get out and make the tackle. Here comes the pressure. Nick felt it. And from behind, he goes down. The man that brought the heat stayed with it. Tyreek Stevenson. No, we see that when we meet with them. And they've got together a few times just throw the football in the backyard. DeAndre Swift for the first down. Low. Now, second down and nine. It is Brian Harrion trying to get it wide. Davidson trying to track him down in Kansas. Well, he'll make the tackle, but not before he got to the 40 yard line. Got to get a horse collar, right? Yes, it is. It's going to be the end of it. There's the end around off the play fake. Kiaris Jackson. Good speed and a good first down run for Georgia. From finally set the throw run on this series. Completes it to Robinson. First down inside the 20. Behind from play action. Jake lofts it to the corner. Touchdown, Eli Wolf. Much like the Florida completion that ended that game, this one ends in a touchdown. Number three, empty backfield for Bo Nix. Nix throws out on the flat, compete to Seth Williams. Another catch for him. And trying to fight for a first down. He might get there. And I think he's going to today. And one was out of bounds when he threw it. This is going to be short, too, but it's going to be good enough for a first down to Will Hastings on the dog side of midfield. Nix play fake, deep middle. Got his man. And it's Shedrick Jackson. So they finally got a big play. As you said, that time he kept it in his dominant hand and tucked it high and tight. And now the first down run is Booby Whitlow. Got to stop a fourth and five right here. Nick slants incomplete. Uh -oh. The flag comes in on Stokes. Yes, it is. Oh, yes. And that time the big body of J.J. Wilson paid Pass interference. Number 27 in the defense. Penalty places the ball to the spot of the foul with automatic first down. Deep on and out of the end zone. Nix, the throw out in the flat. It's still not a rushing touchdown, but it's an Auburn touchdown to Eli Stone. <laughs> Bonitz, his team trailing by two touchdowns down the middle of Seth Williams' his favorite target. And it's down to the 35 for 24. And looking for more, the side armor out to Williams again. He broke a tackle. Seth Williams down to the 20. Stack receivers both ways, but the give is to Whitlow. Waits for his blocking. Got it down first and goal. Nix keeps it. Dives. Touchdown, Auburn. Here we go. They're coming again from late throw, incomplete, broken up by McCreary. Short. They'll keep it on the ground to Whitlow, and he's got a big run out to the 45. Georgia just brings four. Knicks wanted to get rid of it in the hurry. Now he's going to run, and he's going to get it. First down. This has shades of that Oregon game. Going to do the quick huddle. And Huddle's only about two yards away from the line of scrimmage. Up they come. Nix is going to be under center. That's a rarity. He fakes it. Bootleg throws in the flat. In and out of the hands of Harold Joyner. Incomplete. Bad throw. Third and five. Throws in the flat to DeAndre Swift. Can he make anybody miss? No. Not that time. Bonitz. Set to fire again. Or will he? He's not going to get it. He's sacked that time by Trayvon Walker. They finally get home. And their coach hits the turf in celebration on the sideline. But watch the stunt at the end. From the outside, Adam Anderson comes in to make it four. And dear life. I got a feeling Chamberlain Smith's going to get a game ball from Georgia. She did her job. As Gary said, Georgia did its job. Big win. As the dogs hold on to win 21 to 14, and they are the SEC East champions again.